Acute responses to exercise are changes to your body to meet the increased energy requirements as we transition from rest to exercise. Chronic exercise can be defined as a repeated amount of bouts of exercise during a short or long period of time. What's going on, everybody? Uh, this is Coach Wallace here to talk to you about the effects of exercise, the acute response versus the chronic response to exercise. Here are some key points as how exercise affects the body physiologically. The first question is, how does, does exercise affect the body by increasing respiratory capacity? Is that an acute response or is that a chronic response? The answer is, it is a chronic response. So as you are exercising on a regular basis, over time, your respiratory capacity will increase. That means you have the ability to uh, breathe better over time. Question number two, does is exercise does exercise, exercise decrease blood pressure in moderately in hypertensive individuals? Is that an acute response or a chronic response? The answer is, that's a chronic response. If you have hypertension, that means that your body, your, your blood pressure is elevated. As you exercise over, and consistently exercise over a period of time, it will decrease your blood pressure over time. Okay. Question number three is does exercise increase cardiac output is that an acute response or a chronic response the answer is exercise increases cardiac output that's acute that's an acute response as you as we know the equation for cardiac output is stroke volume times heart rate so as your stroke volume or your heart rate increases, that causes you to uh, expunge or expel more uh, blood from the heart. So that's an increase in your cardiac output. Question number four, does exercise lower the resting heart rate? Is that an acute response or a chronic response? The answer is, it is a chronic response. So as you exercise, your heart rate decreases become, because your heart now is more efficient at pumping the blood throughout your, your system, your body. Question number five. This is loaded, okay? Uh, question number five is exercise, does exercise increase aerobic capacity? Is that an acute response or a chronic response? The answer is, Exercise increases aerobic capacity. That is a chronic response. Again, the key concept with exercise is that you are consistent in your journey on your transformation. So that increases your aerobic capacity or your ability to do more exercise, do it at a, a more intense rate, uh, work harder, and be more efficient at the work that you're doing. Last but definitely not least, ex does exercise increase systolic blood pressure the answer is is that an acute response or a chronic response the answer is that is an acute response exercise as we exercise our blood pressure automatically goes up systolic blood pressure is how well your body is how your body contracts uh doing a heartbeat so as you exercise your systolic blood pressure will go up instantaneously Hey, stay, stay tuned, Con like, continue to like our videos, continue to watch the videos, be blessed, see you next time.